Good morning, beautiful people. How's it going? I'm at the hospital taking over from my sister. My mom's still here. Um, I don't want to get into the personal details, but uh, I'm just taking over from my sister. Um, you know, there's nothing life threatening uh, about my mom, but uh, you know, it's kind of serious. So, just gonna go in and you know, sit with my mom and make sure everything's okay. Hey guys, it's like uh, it's like two in the morning. Just hanging out with my mom and um, spoke to the doctor. Uh, they just told me basically just go home. She's pretty much passed out. Um, I'll come back tomorrow morning. Uh, no update as of yet, but she seems okay. She's a trooper. Um, I can't really give out much more information than that at the moment. But uh, just gonna head home now. Pass out and then come back. It's just um, just really stressful, you know. Um, I know everything's gonna be okay, but it just, you know, still plays in the back of your mind. But uh, see how it goes tomorrow. So I'm heading home. Hey guys, what's happening? It's uh, 11:30 um, last night when I got home. Well, this morning, I crashed for a bit and I had to get up, drop the girls off to school, came back, and then I had to get some stuff done for work. Don't worry, uh, my dad's with mom right now. Um, there's been no progress in her situation, no idea what's going on. Uh, one of the doctors hasn't seen her yet, so still waiting on that. Um, wifey's gonna go now, hang out there for a bit, because then I gotta pick up the girls, feed them, you know, they got skating and stuff, so it's a family coordinated effort today, and then I'll go in the evening. Um, so it's just, just been really stressful, you know what I mean? Not knowing any information. I'm not designed like that. I don't like, you know, uncertainty because my whole life I've, you know, set my own path. I've known what I want to do. I've had all the answers and it's just, I just feel helpless. You know what I mean? Um, so, but you know, I, I gotta have, you know, I have faith in the medical system. So I, I'm pretty sure everything will be okay. But until you know what's going on, it's really hard for me to understand. So. But uh, we'll take it and play by ear. I'm just gonna grab a quick bite to eat, come back downstairs and get back to work. Hey guys, how's it going? Um, just wanna quickly give you guys a little tip. Uh, you know me, I'm always looking to get better on YouTube and take some of the trainings and something came up uh, on my Twitter feed uh, that YouTube Creators is putting on. It's basically a monetization bootcamp, which is kinda cool. So those of you that are interested, uh, if you wanna go on my Twitter, um, I'll leave my Twitter handle. Um, in the description, but it's basically my name at Amin Panasar, and uh, you'll see one of my retweets. But it's right there. That's basically what it is. Let me try to zoom in on that. So that's the um, uh, the Twitter link. But I'll also leave a link of the actual boot camp um, URL in the description as well, that you guys can sign up for it. So I'd highly recommend it. I've already signed up. And it should be pretty good. Hey fam, what's happening? It's three o'clock and I just came upstairs to refill on my jaw. Um, no updates as of yet on uh, my mom. My dad's there right now, wifey's still there. She's gonna leave pretty soon here to go grab the girls, drop Reese off to skating, then bring Selena home. Then I'm gonna head to the hospital for six o'clock and hang out there all evening. Um, I believe the doctor will be there in the evening so we can kind of see what the next steps are and what's going on. So we haven't heard anything. I know um, it's the medical system here, unfortunately, but uh, you know, got to deal with the cards I'm dealt with, unfortunately. But uh, again, I'm positive, gonna stay positive. I, you know, I'm pretty sure everything's okay. But uh, you know, she's in good hands, so I'm not, you know, concerned at this moment in time. But just gonna restock and head back downstairs. Fam, how's it going? I'm just uh, on my way to the hospital to go see mom, uh, gonna meet with uh, one of the lead doctors there, figure out what the next course of action is. So again, I've got zero information at this moment in time. Gonna go meet with them, see what they say. Uh, Mom's still in the hospital on antibiotics, so hoping that things work out. So I'm heading there now. Alright fam, I'm here at the hospital, just gonna walk in, 
head upstairs to see mom. Um, I think she's pretty much knocked out from all the uh, antibiotics and stuff, but we'll see. And the doctor should be there right about now too, so we can talk to him about the next steps. But uh, I'm gonna get inside and uh, talk to you guys in a bit. All right, fam. So pretty relieved. Um, spoke to the doctors and mom gonna be okay. No operations required at this moment in time. Uh, the antibiotics that she's on seem to be working. So again, I don't want to get into too many details, um, but uh, I think you know everything's gonna be all right. I think she's gonna pull through. So that's actually really, really relieving. Um, it's taking a lot of stress off my mind. Um, it's good. It's really good news. So next couple of days she'll be in the hospital, see how things go. But uh, she looks so much better today, honestly, so much better. So just to uh, grab some food and some drinks for my dad. He's been here pretty much all day, just um, you know, hanging out with my mom. So things are good. Again, we're relieved. He's strong. He's not showing any emotions, but you know, he still was worried. I'm pretty sure. But it's good so far. But he needs some food in his system. So I'm gonna feed him. Chill out, my sister's gonna come down, and we should be good. All right fam, so it's around nine o'clock, I'm just heading back. Uh, my sister just got here, so she's gonna stay with her, and then I'll come back tomorrow. But uh, you know what, she's good. She's looking good, she's really strong. She was, you know, totally different than yesterday uh, when I was here, much better. Um, so it's very, very good, very, very relieving. Um, I think uh, she's gonna be in here for a couple of days because the doctors wanna basically you know, keep her in, keep on the antibiotics, and flush whatever is in her system out. So, you know, like I said, trusted the system. Yeah, I was worried in the sense just because, you know, it's my mom, you know, when it's your parents, you know, they get older, just natural, so. But everything seems okay. Uh, we'll just play by ear the next couple of days. Um, you know, it's been, like I said, very stressful, but I'm gonna get back home and uh, pretty much shower and get to bed because I'm absolutely exhausted and shattered. It's just been, uh, it's been a tough few days, man. Um, pretty emotional as well, but um, I'm gonna get back and basically, you know, hit the sack, but if you're watching this vlog, it's probably late, and I apologize for that, but I hope you understand why. See you guys, just got home. Um, gonna go upstairs now and shower and get to bed. I'm absolutely exhausted. I've been up for, oh man, I don't even know how long, so, and, you know, barely got any sleep. But I wanna say, if you're watching the vlog for the very first time, you know what, thank you very much. I greatly appreciate it. Please subscribe, be part of the family. Of course, to all my peeps, be you, stay optimistic, and just a big high five from me to all of you. Thank you.